you know that there's been changes to the bulk pickup in Charlotte County? Hi, I'm Tom Lloyd with CCTV, and joining me right now is Jake Henderson from Solid Waste. How you doing, Jake? Good, Tom. How are you? And Jake, talk to us about this new change to bulk pickup. The policy changed. Mm -hmm. the, the old policy, the way it was written, you got two bulk pickups per year. Okay. That, up to 20 cubic yards. The new policy that started October 1st gives you bulk pickup every single week up to four cubic yards. So you can set out a four cubic yard yard waste pile, a four cubic yard bulk waste pile, meaning household items, furniture, things that won't fit in your cart. That's what's considered a bulky item. This is not for household garbage. We don't want to see a bunch of bags of trash out there. This is for bulky items. This is replacing the policy that was in existence previously. You can put out um, yard waste or like just the household stuff. Bulky correct? household items, yes. On your normal day. On your normal day. You just take it out to the curb. Uh, and we want one pile either or. We don't want two four yard piles, one of yard waste and one of household goods. It needs to be one or the other. So Jake, show me what is four cubic yards? What do we have right here behind us? So Tom, right behind us, we have a pile of yard waste, of green waste, mm -hmm. uh, vegetative waste, trimming, yard trimmings, clippings, uh, things that come from your developed lot. So that can't come from a, a vacant lot, it has to come from your improved lot. Mm -hmm. uh, this pile is a, is a good example of four cubic yards of what four cubic yards of green waste would look like. Uh, and of course you guys would like to have that bundled, correct? This pile does not have to be bundled. It uh -huh. can just be loose. Okay. Uh, waste management, when they come by to pick it up, they're gonna have a truck that uses a claw that will come down and, and pick it up. You don't have to prepare it. Mm -hmm. So you can just set it out uh, as neat as you can, just for your own yard uh, would be recommended. But no, it doesn't have to be prepared. What if they have yard waste that's over four cubic yards? The pile can't be over four yards. If the pile is over four yards, waste management will pick up four yards. Mm -hmm. They will leave the excess and they'll put a tag on it, leaving you a quote for how much it would cost for waste management to remove that pile. Do you, you know, know what the typical average would be? Uh, it, it's typically around $10 a yard. Okay. And, and what we would like to see and, and what is actually required, if you have over, 10 yard, over four yards and waste management picks up the four yards and leaves the excess, you need to bring that back from your curb within 24 hours. That can't sit at the curb. We mm -hmm. don't want your neighborhood to have this stuff sitting out and waiting till next week. It okay. needs to come back from okay. the curb. Okay. Now, if you have excess of four yards, there are, there are alternatives. And what we have, what you can do is you can have properly prepared bundles of yard waste. Mm -hmm. uh, you can put it in paper bags, such as the bags that come from Home Depot or whatever, uh, or you can also have cans of yard waste. Those can't weigh more than 40 pounds, okay. but you can have up to 10 of any one of those combination of items. Okay. And we do show an example of a properly prepared So bundle. I'm assuming this is it right here. This Good. is a properly prepared bundle. So waste management can pick that up, they throw it in the truck. You can have 10 of these in okay. addition to your four yards Okay. of waste. Okay. So that's how you can have excess of four yards. Okay, why don't you come over here and show me this right over here. Okay. All right, so Jake, talk to me about this display. What do we have right here? Okay, so Tom, this is four cubic yards of an example of household bulky items. So you've got furniture, you've got mattresses, windows. Uh, that's more of a screen. We don't really want construction debris. Um, lawn chairs. Uh, these are items that wouldn't fit in your cart normally. So that's mm -hmm. what constitutes a bulky item. Uh, I do want to remind you that you can't have more than four yards. You can set out up to four yards. If there is excess, waste management will pick up four yards. They'll leave a tag on the remainder, giving you a quote for how much it would cost to haul that away. Outstanding. So Jake, we have like furniture here. We've got like some mattresses. This is all household goods or, or, or tr household, household trash, trash basically items. items that you guys would normally pick up during normal pickup. Correct. This is your normal weekly pickup on your scheduled day. Uh, waste management comes by, they pick up your cart for your garbage, they pick up your recycling. There's a truck that will come by at a later time and pick up your bulk waste. Okay. Uh, that, that's important, Tom, because a lot of people 
think when the garbage truck goes by, they're gonna take everything. They don't take everything. There's a separate truck that will come by to get your bulky items or your yard, your bulk yard waste. So like things like these, like this, these mattresses and like, like this here, like this window, broken window, yes. or any of these other different like lawn furniture and things like that. These are the things that you guys would take. That's correct. And as long as it's four cubic yards. As long as it's four cubic yards and not excess of four cubic yards. Outstanding. And not regular garbage. We don't want piles of bags of garbage from your kitchen to come out here. Mm. That goes in your cart, that's where it belongs. Well, Jake, thanks a lot for explaining the new changes to bulk pickup. And if anybody has any information or wants more information, excuse me, where, they, where can they go to find more information about the bulk? changes good question tom you can always go to our website at uh, charlottecountyfl.gov and select the garbage and recycling page or you can just give us a call 941-764-4360 perfect we'll be happy to answer any questions that you may have outstanding and remember if you want to know about those changes there are changes to the new bulk pickup go ahead and check it out on the website for cctv i'm tom lloyd